So does uh, Activate support AI and RPA? So the short answer is yes. The longer answer is um, when you go through the Activate front end, uh, you will find guidance that will, that will basically start with exploring the AI and RPA scenarios early in the process. So we start in prepare phase and then take you through using uh, those scenarios and pre-built RPA um, uh, bots to design the, the process. Uh, so it's used throughout the explore phase and then we build on that as you, as you go through Activate. We have worked uh, quite diligently about two years ago uh, with our team that's focusing on AI topics to create the initial content in Activate for AI and RPA, and we continue to enhance it. Uh, just recently, we have added uh, uh, business-driven configuration questionnaires into Activate around these AI topics, uh, and you know this is an asset that gets continuous updates as we as we progress. You also find a it's a menu of these RPA use cases and AI use cases for different parts of the solution inside Activate. Um, and that will help you to steer the conversations in fit to standard uh, when, you, when you're exploring how to use those uh, technologies to your advantage. Yeah, and just adding on, adding on to it, yeah. I mean, you wouldn't see these AI uh, and uh, RPA as a separate one. It you will always see that as a part of the business processes. Yeah. So this is all about bringing value to the existing business processes. So you will see that it's completely interlaced in that business process. But just for usability, we would have tried to give it as another dimension. But in most of the cases, it's not a standout capability. It's a different, separate function. It is something that brings value to your existing business processes.